Hello all, we are trying to simulate a circuit using the op-amp that is present in the library. So for example, if you go to the library and type op-amp, okay, this is the generic op-amp that you, you get from here. And uh, the parameters are, um, can be known by right clicking on this particular component. Now. This particular circuit, what you see here, is called a adder subtractor circuit. Okay, so now in this adder subtractor circuit, you have uh, total four voltages that are provided, and output will be um, the equivalent voltage that is nothing but um, five plus five. Okay, sorry, five plus five on the non inverting terminal minus. 5 plus 5 which will equivalent to be 0. So that will be the output of this particular op amp. So we will talk about how adder subtractor circuit works in another video. Um, so for understanding purpose, so this is a uh, simple op amp based circuit. Now we are trying to simulate this. Okay. When we are trying to simulate this, so the first thing let us see the uh, simulate command. Okay, we are giving a transient analysis, we, uh, which we are doing for a period of one millisecond. Okay, and we are trying to simulate. When we are trying to simulate, it says unknown sub-circuit called in. What do you mean by this is? Mm, and uh, um, it also says uh, the given nodes and then the refdes and it gives the op-amp which we have used and its um, specifications. Now, what this means is the actual error, right? Unknown subcircuit called in. So what this means is this op amp is unable to link to any of the uh, library component that is there. Unless there is a model that is being associated with this particular uh, op amp, this will not be able to simulate, right? So it has to be associated with some model, okay? So, for that, uh, what we have to do is go to dot op, okay. You can include op amp dot sub. So, what we are saying is basically we are actually trying to include the sub circuit of this op amp, that means the uh, actual uh, model that is present in the background, and trying to include here, okay. You can see the name is also op amp here, okay case let us try to see if this works okay you can see it passed without any error and when we try to measure the output you can see it is zero volts which is expected output so that means when we are using a generic op amp from the library of lt spice it is important that we include the sub of that op amp 